Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to share how I made the gingerbread man tag. You can grab this SVG on my blog at ccdsmith.com and just type in gingerbread man and you will find my blog post along with a free file that you can download for your own cutting machine software. So I'm in design space and let's go ahead and click upload. And I've already downloaded the file, so just click on this image and just click insert. And see how it comes up large like this? It's no big deal since the image is still selected just go on up here on the top panel and change the sizing to what I want. I'm just going to grab this and place it up here, stretch it up a bit for a better view. And as you can see all of these layers on the right side panel, I will not be using all of these so I'm just going to ungroup. Then select these right here because I will not be using them. You can either hide them or delete them. In my case, I'm just going to delete them. So on the Layers tab, we now only have six layers. Now let's go to the Color Sync tab and it shows you right here that there are six colors. The gingerbread is supposed to be just white, so I'm just going to drag him up here with the white. The black one is for writing. This red is for plain red cardstock. And then I will be using a red pattern paper for this lighter red. And the gingerbread man will be for the brown cardstock. So now let's go back and click on the layers tab. I'm just going up here to resize the image again to what I need. Then zoom in for a better view. So now I'm just going to ungroup the image, then move these pieces on the side. And just a reminder, I'm going to use patterned paper for this layer. And on the text, you can resize or move it around if you'd like. And on the Layers tab, it shows you that the text is a cut. Now let's go to the line type up here, so I can change the text from cut to draw. In the box next to it, you get to choose which pen you're using, and I'm just using my black Cricut Fine Pen. So now let's go ahead and select the text and the shape, then click Attach, then click Make It. We are now on the preview screen and it shows you how many mats there will be. Now let's go back to mat number one and click Continue. Choose your settings and I'm choosing cardstock. And right here it tells you to load the mat and what tools and blade you will be using. So I'm just going to load the mat into my machine. Then grab my pen to insert it into slot A. And see this triangle right here? This is just a guide. Now let's go ahead and open slot A to insert the pen. And see where my finger is? I'm just holding it up for support while I insert the pen with my other hand and push and you'll hear the click. The triangle is no longer visible, now close the slot A. Now that I'm done, I'm just going to hit start on my machine. So first it's going to write the text. Once that's done, it'll start cutting. Now that it's done, unload mat number one. We are now moving to mat number two, which I've already removed the pen from the slot A. Just load the mat and hit start. Once it's done cutting, just unload and do the same process for mat number three and mat number four. Now that all the cutting is done, it is time to assemble. I'm just grabbing one of the smaller pieces and put some glue on it. And I am using a tweezer to help me place this on top of the outline of the image. Then I use my double sided tape to put these pieces together.
I'm using a foam mounting tape to place it on the gingerbread man for more of a 3D look. I'm just adding a snowflake and I got this from Dollar Tree. And for the ribbon, these were from last year and I purchased these from Michaels, but any ribbon would work. I'm gonna cut a piece of the ribbon, then insert from the back of the tag and just tie a knot. The ribbon is curling a bit, so I'm just trying to straighten it so you guys can see. And there you go. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up or leave me a comment. And don't forget to grab that free file on my blog. And I will link everything under the description box in case you guys needed it. Have a great day and thank you for watching. Bye guys.